Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Richard Miller, and welcome back to the basic, um, not actually basic, um, uh, Java tutorial, bucket tutorial. So the last episode, we learned how to do a command where you, if you type in test, it'll send them the message, you have created a basic plugin. Today, what I have in store is multiple commands and giving players items. So let's do that really quickly. Alright, so basically, with multiple commands, it's pretty simple. So basically, you have your first command here. Now, what you want to do next is after your this first return true, you want to put your next one. So if command label dot equals ignore case, and then um this guy he pn me he wanted to do some things, but um I'm just going to use his example. So if they enter the command website it will do the following. It will do p dot send message. So once again that sends the message to the player. Chat color dot um let's just do aqua and then plus of course and then my website is uh mc I'm gonna just do website and then colon space and then plus if you want to add different colors dot gray plus uh, mc dash randy pp dot engine dot com. So this is a w easy way to set up two commands, and you want to have a return true right after. So this is how you do two commands, um, pretty basic. So now let's add a third command, and now we're gonna do it. So we add items to the uh, to the uh, what's it called inventory. So let's go ahead and so if command label that equals ignore case if they uh, do the following command kit test um, it will do the following so we can send them a message send message chat color dot um, oh wait to actually there's a different way to do um, two commands like that so you have to do Kit and then there's a you have to do this so you have to we let's start this over so you if you want to have like kit test you have to do if command label dot equals oops equals ignore case kit and then after the parenthesis you want to do and and args dot length equals one and and args and then open up brackets zero dot equals ignore case and then test and then you can open up that bracket again so basically this is how you can use it to have kit test and here oh, we forgot to have one more parenthesis so as we were doing here p dot send message so when they pick the kit test it will say gray plus you, I'm gonna just do test kit applied. So that's how you can, and then end it with a colon. So it'll send them a message test kit applied. So now we want to add items to their inventory. So this is really simple. It's really simple. So we want to get the player dot get inventory. So we're getting their inventory dot add item. So we're adding an item, new item stack. So we're adding a new item stack, material, so what it is, and then let's just add a diamond underscore sword, and then end it with a colon. So then you want to import uh, item stack with org dot bucket dot inventory. So basically, it will give them a diamond sword. So that's the basic of how you can do multiple commands and have three commands or more. You can have as many as you want. Just follow this. Um, follow this format so it just add that return true there so yeah so this is how you add it, something to someone's inventory and then I'll go more in depth with that next episode so yeah you can add a basic item to their inventory send them a message so now all we have to do is add it to their plugin.yml so just copy and paste your test thing and then do that twice because we have website and kit test so shows website and then apply kit test so let's go ahead and put this into my server 
So we have all that. We have here, here. Okay, so now let's go ahead and enter it to our server, my server. So you want to export Java jar file, and then we called it the test plugin. All right. So jar creation failed. Uh, it was just a plugin lima. All right. So let's go ahead and open up uh, Minecraft. Um, Minecraft is right here. Okay, right, so we'll open up Minecraft and go ahead and and reload the server. Um, I'll say reloading slash reload. All right, that's complete. Go ahead and play some. Join my server after it loads Minecraft. Okay, so here we go. So I hope you guys have been enjoying this series. I got a pretty good response. So we do slash website. And there you go, mc-randypp.engine.com. That worked, slash test, that still works. You have created a basic plugin, and slash kit test. And uh, that doesn't work. Let's see why that didn't work. Command label dot. All right, guys, so I found out the problem. Um, basically, it didn't work because I had already something that did kit, something like that. So. Well, basically, I just made it kit test with no space. Um, I'll go into detail next time on how to do it with a space, but this is how you do. So just make it kit test with um, like that. So you change it in your plugin YML, kit test, and then you export it, of course. And then, so now it works. Kit, kit test, kit test, and so it gives you a diamond sword. So I hope you guys enjoyed. And um, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. I'm sorry it wasn't very thorough. Well, it was pretty thorough. It, um, sorry for that big error there. But I will be fixing that. Um, I'll go over that in the next episode. So I hope you guys enjoyed. And we'll see you next time, guys. Peace.